Beautiful people of YouTube, my name is Oliver Cat, and welcome back today. We are going to be playing Magisite. Magisite is, actually this game came out a while ago, and I'm just getting to play it now. But it is a roguelike with a little bit of crafting elements of Minecraft. I'm not saying rip off. Every time I, say, every time I feel like I compare a game to Minecraft, I feel like I'm selling it short. Because, in a sense, this game is its own, it's its own thing. But, uh, you know, just so you guys have a decent understanding of what I'm talking about when it, when the crafting system is brought up. So this is the, I guess this is your character creation screen. Now you gotta keep in mind that every time you lose a character, this is a roguelike. Every time you lose a character, you die and it's dead, it's gone. But uh, there are different ways to set up different characters. I'm gonna do something basic and I'm just gonna make a warrior class. Now uh, here, on this side right here, are two different stats that will kind of benefit your character in one way or another like you'd see here intelligence plus two magic and then here poison brewer blah 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 so what I want to do is find two stats that I think will be suitable uh, for a warrior build so that's what I'm gonna try and do build a warrior so give me one second to find two stats now I found two stats but one thing I don't understand is it says right here plus two attack and negative one defense but there's no defense here. I don't see anything re relating to defense. But anyways, I found two stats. Aggressive and, excuse me, uh, Blockmaster allows you to open golden chests. In the early game, if there's any golden chests in the first few levels, that's a benefit to you. On top of that, these little uh, trade attributes that you have here, you can wear hats. And these hats also give you um, different, uh, different bonuses. So, for example, the one I'm going to be using is the Berserker Scarf. Now, these are relatively easy scarves you unlock, and you see that there's quite a few. So, th this scarf was worn by a legendary warrior who died fighting the Scourge in the early days of Deep Haven. 33% chance on leveling up to gain an additional attack stat. So, every time I level up, I have a 33% chance of gaining an additional attack stat. Now, if this, if, uh, this scarf procs often every time I level up, then I will pretty much out-level or I'll power everything uh, as I go on. So we're gonna select this, and uh, there is companions that you can get in this game too, but I have not unlocked any just yet, unfortunately. And there are also races, so let me see which one will give me the benefit, or the better. See, uh, each race also comes with like s different starting items. The human, or peon, I guess that's what it's called, uh, would come with an axe and two random starting items, where the Orclops would come starting with a bone sword and a pickaxe. So let me see which of the two will get me higher attacks, six and four, and then, oop. Uh, I also unlocked, see that, you can, there's different variants that you can get for each of the classes, or each of the races. Uh, I actually just unlocked that one right now, so I'm going to use that. But, um, let's see, uh, six and four. Not like I've... Okay, so it's basically the same thing. Now, for starters, it's easier just using the peon or the human, if you want, whatever. So I'm just going to start off with him, and let's see where we go. Now, be honest with you guys. Let me see something real quick. I hope, hopefully the music isn't that loud. I hope not. Let me move the mic a little closer to me. I hope that the music isn't too loud. Anyways. Um... Just so you guys know, I suck at this game, and actually pretty badly, so I'm going to try my best not to fuck up, and try and see how far I can go. So here we go. Oh, no! Really have to focus. God, get out of here. Really have to focus so I don't die, so if I get a little quiet, don't mind me. I'm just trying not to fuck up doing pretty good I have played this game a little bit so I'm not like bad bad but I do tend to mess up a lot especially during the later nope I missed I missed come on no ah, I missed again no range on this b potion bottle that I'm oh there we go got him nailed him all right so let me get my axe back out now from what I've seen, it's recommended in the early levels to get as many items as you possibly can. So that's what we are going to aim to do. Uh, you can actually cut down these trees with these axe, with the axe, and we are going to open up my inventory and see what I got so far. 
What I'm going to do is I'm going to make a pickaxe uh, right now. The way you do that, uh, hold down shift, click. So now we got an axe handle. Oh, I think I... Did I do it wrong? Yes, I did. I did it wrong. I'm awesome at showing you guys what to do. So for the time being, what I'm going to do is just this. And that will make a wooden blade. Now, I don't want to make an axe. I, or, the tool depends on the type of a, uh, the handle you have. It's hard to say, but yeah, that. So what I want to do is to actually go over here. Oop, let me close this inventory. I'm going to cut down these trees. And we're going to open this up. Inventory. So let's try this again. Now, if I'm right, it's like that. Yeah, pickaxe handle. And then we'll get the blade and put it on the pickaxe. And now we have a pickaxe. Or the pickaxe handle. Uh, you know what I mean. So now we got that. So you see where I, I told you that there are certain similarities to like the crafting on Minecraft. But it's not like a complete rip off. Um, so now I'm going to make some extra potion bottles. Because I see that I have herbs here. And like that. Got that. And... We're going to cut down a few more trees, then we're going to go for the stones. And then with the stones, we'll use that to make a, a stone sword. See, pretty straightforward when it comes to crafting. I mean, if you played Minecraft, you kind of have an idea of how it goes. Now, again, I'm no expert in the game, but you saw how that last stone had, like, yellow on it. I'm assuming that once you get a better pickaxe, something better than stone... Um, whatever is in there will actually come out. In a sense, when you use a, a crude pickaxe, um, you kind of ruin what's in there when you mine it, so you don't get it. Now we are going to make another, we're going to make another handle. So we got that hand, I shouldn't have made that handle, I had, I had another handle sitting right there. I'm going to take this, take a wooden plank to one handle, and totally mess that up. That's not, is it like that? It's not like that. Uh, so confusing. Let me drop that. This and this, and huh? Is it like that? Yep. There you go. Okay. Sword hilt. So with a wooden plank and a wooden stick, you can put those together and make a sword hilt, which is different than a handle. You can take this. And I actually didn't want to make a... <laughs> oh god, I'm not even paying attention to what I'm doing. I'm not, I didn't want to make a wooden one, but I'll keep that to the side. I'll actually use that for my... For that affair. And what I need is actually one more stone to make a stone sword. So I'm going to keep mining resources. Get all these resources here. And let me open up my inventory. Get my pickaxe back out. Don't know why it's in my inventory. Mine this here. There we go. We got a stone. Gonna take these two stones and make a refined stone again, put them together, and then back to the handle. Woo! A lot of instructions, but there it is. Now we're gonna take on that monster up there. Pick some mess. I don't need this bow. Actually, I'll keep it so I can sell it when I head to the next town. And uh, oop, throwing out my food. You do have a hunger meter in this game, and you do get hungry. And I believe when you get hungry, you do end up dying. So it's important to eat get my come on up here okay try and see if I can take this guy out yeah oh all right no no die now I've never never really experienced what happens when that like the music just kicked it oh my god no 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 Holy shit! <coughs> uh. <laughs> so yeah, that's my first time ever seeing that. Uh. We'll try that again. We'll try that again. Oh mother fuck! What the fuck? All right, this game is really unfair. It's being real unfair to me right now. Yeah. Try that again. Ah. Uh. Die! And it runs so fast too. Alright, I fucked up. Try again. 
There was literally no escaping that monster. We're gonna try that again. I can't believe... See, in my horrible method of explaining to people how to play the game, I kind of forgot to rush the level a little bit. Kind of taking my time. Usually, when that happens, I bail. I don't stick long enough, to stick around long enough to see what is going on. Let's have, let's try a different race. We'll try the uh, Orclops. And uh, put that variant. Variant. Why not? Sure. Uh, let's see. What do I want? Uh, we're gonna try and go for another warrior build. So anything with aggressive. No, I don't want that. Uh, that should... That's okay, I guess. Chance to collect twice as many ingredients when gathering. Alright, we can do that. Now, the problem with using a... A orc is... They start with no hatchet. So, it's your... Basically, your goal in the beginning of the game is to try and get as ha a hatchet as fast as possible to help upgrade your shit. No! Out! Go away! Wow. He's like, no, I'm not having it. I mean, Alright, fine. You stay up there, then. Gonna move over here. And let's see if... Yep. Die! Oh, Almost got that in the face. You know what? I'm gonna back up. Whoa, there's a little lag spike going on. I don't know what that's about. Die! There we go. Got him. Alright, cool. But, uh, as a bonus, you do start off with a good pickaxe. Or a decent pickaxe, at least. See, we got that. Alrighty, now we're gonna just... I'm gonna skip the bee. Fuck the bee. Fuck bees, if you know what I mean. Uh, I'm not gonna try and attack that monster there, because... There's too many of those little spots. Ah! Now, I'm not sure why, on the first level, they would decide to put a monster of that strength there. see if I can take this monster out. If not, then I'm probably gonna die. Can you move? Can you move? Oh god, I'm gonna go! Come on, no, 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 too many monsters! Ah, no! No! This game is wrecking me right now. Wrecking me. So we're gonna keep going. That wasn't a good level. That definitely wasn't a good level for stars, especially the class I was running, or the race I was running, at least. No. That's no bueno. Then again, I do suck balls at this game. Ah. Die. No. I'm trying to, like, be slick with it, you know, like, hit him in midair was not working out for me. Dead. 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 Now, I really need... I need more stone, and if I get the chance, I'll be able to make a stone hatchet, which will benefit me. Oh! Level up. You know what? I forgot to put on a hat. I literally forgot to put on a hat. That's okay, I'm a noob at this game anyways. Ah! So I might be able to make a... Refined bone. No, I'm bo I won't be able to make one. God. Ah! At least I have refined bone for whatever I may or may not need it for in the future. Alrighty. Sorry about that. Had to fix my mic. Alright, so let's go back down here. Take some oh, come on. Come on, come get it. Come get some. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to make some potions because they are greatly needed right now. There we go. Three potions. Uh, we got some ore there. Uh, we can put these two together. And can I put this together with that? I guess not. I have to take that to a furnace. That's ore right there. And what are we going to do? We're going to keep going for... Actually, we're going to have a few sips of fucking potions because I am low on health. And we're going to take on this... Oh, no! No! Alrighty guys, so I'm going to end the video, at least my first Let's Play Magicite there. If you guys are interested in seeing me play more of this game, I'm more than welcome to, to do it. I like this game a lot, it's pretty cool. And to be honest, I haven't really gotten far in it, so I don't know what to expect. 
Um, so if you guys are interested in seeing more Let's Plays of this game, again, let me know. I'm going to end the video here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please drop a like. If you are new to my channel and want to see more of my content, go ahead and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I'll see you guys later. My name is Oliver Cat, and I'm signing off. Goodbye.